everyone and welcome back to my American Girl channel. So today I'm going to do a really exciting video that so far I haven't seen anyone do this. Um, as far as I know, this is my original own idea for this type of video. Basically, I saw this meme. I think I was on um, like Instagram or Facebook or something and basically the meme just says you have 30 minutes to spend $5,000 inside one store. Where are you going? And obviously, since this is an American Girl channel, you know that I would spend all of my money at the American Girl store. But um, I filmed this video before and I tried to do it in 30 minutes, but my internet is just so slow. I highly invite all of you watching this to make your own versions of this video. I, and if you do make your own version of this video, make sure to message me on Instagram. I would really like to see what you get. So without further ado, let's get started. As you can see, we just have all the historical characters here with these really cool pictures. These pictures are fantastic. Yeah, I have been thinking about Rebecca a lot. I'm also going to add Rebecca's menorah and dreidel set. And look at this picture. Isn't it so adorable? It's so cute. And I love her little face. She's such a cutie. I, if you know me, I got Mary Ellen for my birthday and she is my absolute favorite at the moment. And I cannot buy the poodle skirt in Canada. So I'm going to buy the poodle skirt, which is my most um, wanted outfit. Next, I'm gonna get Mary Ellen's Seaside Diner because um, I think it's so cute. Even though I know realistically that I have no place to put it, I think it's the cutest thing ever. So I, and I have $5,000 that I have to spend, so I'm gonna add this to bag. Okay, 1149 So I really want Josefina. I've always wanted Josefina since I was a kid because I really, really enjoyed her stories. Um, but I just never got around to getting her because American Girl kept on releasing new dolls. And as a kid, I just wanted to get the new dolls. So I ended up never getting Josefina. But I guess hypothetically, in this imaginary world where I have $5,000, I'm getting Josefina. Isn't she so cute? She's so pretty. And look at her hair absolutely gorgeous and her earrings beautiful outfit is a gorgeous too okay we're gonna add to bag <gasps> you can buy american girl uno on the website oh my god i thought it was just an in-store exclusive <gasps> okay i'm getting i'm getting uno i'm getting american girl uno okay and then i'll get her second book called second chances that's really funny American Girl must be really freaking out thinking that like I'm an actual person buying all this stuff when in reality I'm not. $70 though is very questionable. Yeah, she has this little piece of sushi. 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 It might not even be sushi, but it looks like sushi to me. <gasps> Look at this little picture of her looking through her glasses, looking over her glasses. That's just adorable. I love that. $213 for all this stuff isn't that bad if you think about it. All these little accessories are almost $50. $50 for this. That's insane. So that's some people's grocery month or bill for like uh, a week or something. I don't know. I don't pay for groceries. Um, yeah, my parents are pretty disappointed about that. I want a mini doll of Kaya. Mm, yeah, why not? Why not? Why? I will get the mini doll of Kaya because... I love the Be Forever mini dolls. I know, very unpopular opinion. When I was a kid, I didn't buy the American Girl books because I was like, I can get them from the library. And then recently I went to my library and was like, where's your American Girl books? And they were like, mm, we got rid of them all. And I was like, what? So <laughs> um, 
yeah, I'm kind of sad that I can't reread the American Girl books. So I know the reason I'm going to get, or hypothetically get Courtney, is really silly, but I love red-haired dolls. If you've seen my videos before, the majority of my dolls have red hair, and the majority of the dolls I want happen to have red hair. And I know some of you in the comments are going to be like, oh my god, but Courtney's not a redhead. She's a blonde. Um, you know what? you know what it's red enough hair for me i'm gonna call her a redhead unless i see her in person and i'm like wow this is really not red hair but it looks red enough like strawberry blonde enough for me so i'm gonna call her a redhead until i can see her with my own eyes and conclude that she's blonde but anyways she's going into the cart hey what are you making oh because i was thinking i could make spaghetti and meatballs tonight because Oh, we're getting pizza. Oh, I like pizza. I'm gonna get this sweater, which I've thought about getting for my dolls anyways, even though if I didn't get, like, I'm probably never gonna get Courtney. Um, but just like for my dolls, I think this would be cute. However, it's $18 and I don't even know if I would spend $18 on a sweater for myself. <laughs> so yeah. Okay. And I love this shirt so much because it reminds me of like a certain drama teacher that is in my life or was in my life. I don't know. Saying that he he's not in my life sound, makes it sound like he, he died or something. He didn't. I'm just not in high school anymore. Um, but there was this one. He didn't even he didn't even teach at my high school. Okay, this is kind of like a long winded story. But basically, I did this drama competition, and there was this drama teacher who ran the drama competition at another school. So um, I met him a lot at those competitions, and also he was a family friend because his kids were homeschooled and I was homeschooled. Anyways, this, this is such a long winded story. But basically, this shirt looks like something he would wear, and I love that. So I'm getting this, even though twenty five dollars is <gasps> is that a cosmic brownie? Oh my goodness, I love cosmic brownies. So if you don't know what a cosmic brownie is, I'm gonna show you. This is what a cosmic brownie is. $50, oh my God, the prices of these things? Oh my God, oh my goodness. I'm traumatized by this kind of animation that American Girl has done. I'm scared of it. So the hamster? Oh, it's a guinea pig. Okay, you know what? I'm getting the guinea pig. This girl has a lot of tech going on. She has a lot of, a lot of stuff going on. You know what? I'm gonna get the kit. I know, I'm, I'm, should I get the kit? No. I think I'm gonna see if she has any outfits. If she has any outfits. <gasps> oh my God, they're still selling the Ruthie book. Okay, so fun fact, um, just yesterday, yeah, yesterday, someone was selling the entire American Girl, um, American Girl Kits collection, like her, her books. And I bought it for $15, which is an amazing deal, which is like $2.50 per book, if I calculated that right. But I, it didn't come with Ruthie, Ruthie's book. So, you know what? We're gonna buy Ruthie's book. <sighs> know what? We're gonna do it. I can hear people unsubscribing right now. I feel like my integrity as a person has like disintegrated. Um, but I need to reach this $5,000 mark. And I mean, maybe it's not too bad. Um, maybe? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, what am I doing? Uh oh. Okay, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Oh my goodness. I'm buying a Be Forever kit. Oh my goodness. Yeah, so for those of you who don't know, the reason I'm freaking out so much is because I said in a previous video in American Girl Dolls that I will never buy. It's my most viewed video on my channel. It just reached a thousand views the other day. And I said that I would never buy a kit doll because, or never buy a Be Forever kit because her outfit is atrocious. Um, but look what I'm doing right now. Okay, so I guess she doesn't have any outfits either. What is up with all these dolls not having clothes? Like, what are they supposed to do? Wear the same thing every single day? <sighs> Anyways, um, you know what? We're gonna get a Julie. No, no, we're gonna, we're gonna actually. So you know how I say I'm never gonna buy just like you dolls? Um, oh wait, I wanted... Okay, hold on. We're gonna get a Willy Wisher. We're going to get Willa. Okay, 
the dolls. I guess I could create my own one too. I have enough money to do that. Uh, but I feel like that would be kind of complicated because don't you have to create one? That's I feel like that's just a thing for another video. Okay, so we're gonna do, I think, I want a Blair. Okay, now we're gonna do Blair and then we're gonna do Kira. You know what? We still have a few hundred dollars left. So let's go to the Truly Me's. A lot of things are going on here. So 97 items are on this list and that brings our total to $5,086.83. And I find it hilarious that it says, congratulations, your orders qualifies for free shipping. Wow. <laughs> wow. But then we also, cause I do use the, uh, the app Honey, we're gonna see what coupons. Oh, it said I had coupons, but I didn't. <sighs> Whatever, we gotta remove $80 worth of something. Oh, do I have two Kiras? I have two Kiras, I have... How many Kiras do I have? Okay, so I had to just remove three Kiras um, I don't, and her accessories. I don't know why three ended up in my order, but it, it did. So I'm just gonna go through and double check everything to make sure that we don't have any doubles. Awesome. So I still have $200. So I guess we will get, I guess I know what we're gonna do. We're gonna go and get Julie. You guys can't see me shaking my head right now, but I'm shaking my head right now. Oh my goodness, the accessories look ridiculous. Oh, and there's more to her collection? Oh, mini doll. Okay. Um, yeah, takes a stand, I think it's the- yeah, book two. Alright. Yeah, so we're $50 away. $40 away? Okay, so there's something here I can get for $40. Oh, this is cute. Okay, I'll get this. Alright, so we're $5 away. I am not messing around with it anymore. We got 97 items. Let's go to our shopping bag and see what we got. So, we have spent $4,995.82. We got 97 items, 5 pages on the American Girl Checkout. Um, I would hypothetically donate $5 to the um, Help Australia fund. So that is everything I would buy if I was forced to spend $5,000 in one store. And I got pretty close. I got $5 off. And then of course I would donate the rest. Um, but that's what I would spend if I had to spend $5,000 at American Girl. I would love to see you guys take up this challenge for yourself. So that is it for the video today. 
And I hope you guys liked it and enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it, make sure to subscribe. So that way you're notified when I have new uploads. It is absolutely free to subscribe. And you can also like this video um, because that really, really helps me out. So I think that's it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. And I, oh, follow me on Instagram. I keep on forgetting to mention that. But follow me on Instagram because I post more often on my Instagram than I do on my YouTube. And uh, that's it for today. I'll see you guys next time. And bye. <laughs>